Okay, so at the moment, this is where we are. Basically like half of the way through day three. I don't actually know if we're gonna get it finished, which sucks. But this is where we're at now. So we have got two walls on and that's it so far. But getting the walls on is a pretty big step because that means this part is finished, this part is finished. We're now just doing the other side, the back as well. Just got to cut the wheel arch in, and that one, and that one. Oh, falling over. Then the front door, back, and roof. And then that's basically it done. Um, yeah, it's just from now on, it's kind of seeming to take a little bit longer. A little bit longer than I thought, even in my double expectations. But still looking good. Look at the inside. Look at that. A little tiny house. But yeah, we've had a lot of interest in it with people walking by, which is kind of cool. Um, yeah, oh, and there's going to be a door here. Again, that's how you get in and out. I'm really tired. Okay, so end of day three, although it feels like day seven, doesn't it? We are now, the front is all painted-ish. Forget the fact there's not a door in a fascia. Sides, done. Roof, bodged, but done. Um, other side, done. The rear of it, done. Ish, I just need to, that's all wired in now, that runs underneath to the front. Real arches, still don't know what to do with those. Um, I've got some mud guards down the side over there, but they don't really fit anymore because so we've made them bigger. In case we put bigger tyres on it, but... Yeah, the inside is a dark hole. But it's obviously at the moment just meant for transporting stuff. So... Also, this isn't how high it's going to be. This is how high it's going to be when it's in transit and it's going to pop up further. So, that's what we've got so far. Um, and basically, we're out of time. So, I'm going to have to do some of that stuff like after work, maybe. But, we'll see how we go.